notes, Enoch, Azazel, Dead Sea Strolls. He taught men art of warfare, of making swords, knives, shields, and coats of mail, or the Book of Giants. And Women, the Art of Deception, by ornamentating the body, dyeing the hair, and painting the face and the eyebrows. And also reveal to the people the secrets of witchcraft and corrupted their manners, leading them into wickedness and impurity. Azazel, the Negro, Dot, Savages, and Ghetto Gaggers. They're too close. Check out the flood, check out the flood. That stuff gushing up out of there. That's how it's gone. All this rain coming down. Yeah. Let y'all see a little bit of that. Let's talk about uh Azazel real quick. Azazel was a fallen angel. One of the horde from the fallen angels. And he taught weapons of war. He taught ornamentations, fire as women, fire as them painting their nails, painting their hair, and making themselves uh, very tempting to the other counterpart, which is the man. Everything he taught is going on and is perpetuating itself right up until now. Before the flood period, the angels was, you know, they was with the human beings on earth and they fell to earth and took upon themselves to mess with the son, I mean, the daughters of uh, men, of human beings, and they bore giants. This story is in the Book of Giants, the Book of Enoch, Nathaniel. I mean Nephilim, and um, there's a lot of commentaries, a lot of dialogue, and there's a lot of manuscripts talking about the Dead Sea Strolls. Uh, as I recall, young boy wandered and wandered into a cave over there in that region of that land and found those ancient strolls, manuscripts, what have you, and antiquities and the archaeologists, what have you, got people to decipher the language and there you have it on your world stage the book of Enoch Dead Sea Strolls and the book of Giants all of it coincides and comes together but let's talk about this I'm gonna let y'all get a look at this water again that's what ba that's what basically happened in the time of Noah you see that water but it was a flood the great flood who the great flood that took the inhabitants of mankind out because mankind was wretched, wicked with the teachings of the fallen angels. And they wouldn't listen to the calling of Noah and the doors was closed on them and, he fl and God flooded the earth. Now we're coming to 2016, the same kind of thing is going on and they say fire next time. It's a fellow YouTuber who talks about the, the teachings of this angel. He talks about the hair hair hooligans. Unknowingly, he probably, or he probably do know, 
just comes from and stems from that angel. You feel me? You have Negro women that's blue black walking around with blonde hair, blue eyes. You have men and women, uh, butt implants, penis implants, penis pumps, uh, breast implants, lip implants, tattoos, piercings, and, and, and places that I, I really don't believe they put it at, but they do do it. These things stem from that angel, Azazel. Now I'm out here in this uh, torrential rain, which I don't matter. It don't matter to me because I dress for the for the occasion. I think people need to uh, really think about that instead of looking cute all the time. I got a, 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 a army fatigue raincoat on. Let y'all see it for a minute. Got it from one of my comrades, you know, one of my good friends, because he works at the uh, Andrew Air Force Base in uh, Clinton, Maryland. Allentown Road, you know, stems from Allentown Road, Coventry Way. It's a big installation. And he gave me this coat because he didn't need it no more. You know, he got uh, extra ones, what have you. So he gave these coats out, these raincoats, and I appreciate it. See, that's what I mean. Good friends, good, you need to have good friends in your corner also. But let's get back to uh, this angel, Azazel. So as I partake in this uh, commentary with you all today, God bless me to get up. This weighed heavy on me last night. Really heavy. Because when I read about Azazel, Azazel, the same stuff he taught is going on today. There you have it. You have your, you, you have your Hiroshima Nakashaki. If I'm pronouncing it right, we drop bombs on people twice. Vietnam War, you got your 911s, you got your Saddam Hussein, you got your Osama bin Laden's, you got your Amtrak's, you got your uh, now your Zinka virus that's, that's spreading all population control, germ warfare, chemical war warfare, and scientists tapping in with the genome code and tapping with the DNA of, of God's creation, which is mankind. These things are nothing new under the sun, folks, when it comes to Azazel. This is why this publication had to be brought out because it weighed heavy on Otto Monk's mind. All of my productions want you to get the truth. This is why you have this butchery and fiasco going on on social media. Simply because people are under the spiritual, demonic possession of Azazel. This, you know, he's uh, rumored to uh, be deep in the bowels of. Uh, the portal gate where the angels had, had descended on, which is Mount Hermon, or Hermon, and the UN uh, base sit right on top of that mount. And you wonder why they chose that place for to put that installation there? You can look it up, you can Google it for yourself. There's various videos talking about this. The angel was bound head and foot, uh, chains, Rocks and jagged rocks put deep into the earth till judgment time and bound it and stones and, and, and rocks threw on upon his face so he wouldn't see the light of day. And that's some solitary confinement for you, God style. So let me tell you something, folks. When you have this spirit that's raging in the land, which is the world, the, the, the jazz may not be here with us now, but their spirits are free on the earth to torment mankind. This is why you have to investigate. This is why your churches are being under warfare. As you can see the fiascos happening in these black churches, folks. You got the churches turning to the nightclubs. Some churches are the nightclubs. You got women actually going to church like they've been on a stripper pole. You got some of these clergy looking like they pimps. Now, 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 the safe house is being under attack. We know this. Social media teaches this. 
The stuff these some of these clothes sell their mouth teaches this. Do they get a pass? That's not for me to decide. They got to deal with the uh, most high. But I'm going to tell you, if I don't see, for, for me being an anniversary, if I don't see something being uh, positive, I'm out of there. I don't know about you. You putting your flock in danger, you putting your congregation in danger if you leading your sheep the wrong way. Now, YouTube is my pulpit officially. YouTube is my pulpit officially. I'm using this as a catalyst to spew out my knowledge to the ones that want to hear all of my productions. Now, this is about Azazel. This is a serious topic. These churches are being attacked. The clergy, come on now, y'all got to preach about these books. You know, it's the reason why Constantine and, the, and, and his boys and his cohorts, which is the Sadducees and the uh, Pharisees, uh, took these books out the canon. canon. Why did they take it out? Anything that's taken out, it must be something important that was written in it, don't you think? It might be about the Negro, don't you think? It might be about what we was doing back then, don't you think? Why we keep on being mass car incarcerated? Why we keep on perpetuating these crimes? Why youth is dying? Why uh, why is our women thotting out? Uh, 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 Instagramming out? Uh, uh, ghetto gagging out? Huh? Since y'all want to talk about all these topics, where do you think that stuff stems from? Azazel. Azazel. Too much too soon. And they're talking about, uh, he taught men stuff that was not supposed to be taught. It was taught to them in heaven, and he taught the humans. Ancient technology. Break down the parables. He taught ancient technology. That's what he was teaching. Now, I don't know if the Germans and Hitler and them found that ancient technology when they was digging. Huh? Think about it. All of a sudden, the industrial age, that's from push buggy car and horses, and that, and then subways and uh, 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 all kinds of different engineering infrastructures and building techniques where did that ancient technology come from too much too soon campaigns warfare the proof is in the pudding i mean look at the middle east they've been fighting since biblical times right up until now now something else is going to do in the pot Oh yeah, y'all can get the knowledge today, and y'all can go, you think I'm lying, check it out for yourself. Now you got ISIS rushing the uh, the prophecy. Y'all probably say, all monk, what are you talking about, all monk? Well, I'm talking about, now, they say you can, uh, actually, if you was over there, you can walk across the Euphrates. That's how the water level has gotten in the Euphrates. You see this right here? It's probably even lower than this little creek bed I'm standing on doing this publication with y'all. It's probably lower than that. I know I ain't walking across this. <laughs> but I tell you what, they're trying to rush profs. And they've been talking about this about what? Three or four. They've been talking about this since I've been you know, on YouTube when I uh, decided to start my account. And that was what? 2013, what 2013 or 14, something like that. But anyway. It's drying up, folks. And that's, and, and that's in the good book. It's drying up. I seen a little uh, John on CNN. You can go to various media outlets. They're going to talk about it. Y'all probably say, ain't that in the Bible? Yeah, that's in the Bible. That's the sign. And, they, and ISIS is rushing it. They damming it up. They trying to dry it up even more faster. But they won't tell you this on public news, folks. That's why I know the DOD wish they ain't put the internet, they ain't bring the internet out to the main mainstream public. I know they wish they never done this. But now it's out. People are investigating people like me, and we finding out certain things and connecting the goddamn dots. 
I mean, um, I don't know what else to say to y'all. All I know, if y'all don't believe me, read the book of Enoch, please. Read about Azazel. Everything he taught is happening right now. Instagram. Go see it for yourself, Foster Women. Get old gaggers. Go see it. Now, I was going to put this. Nah, I'm going to put this in another video. This is, this is going to be about these brothers talking about the black men as the laughing stock of civilization. But this got to something. This video I want to produce next, it got something to do with sexual dysfunction. Now, mankind is becoming the laughing stock after you hear this of civilization. I'm going to tell you why. It's something deeper to that. And to all you brothers keep on talking about black men or a last, last in a race of a success, I'm going I'm to I'm I'm destroy all that when I come up with this next video. But I'm going to stick to this Azazel thing. Now, like I was saying, y'all gonna get that though. Y'all gonna get that second video. Oh yeah, y'all getting it today. Y'all see what I'm talking about. I'm not gonna say the title though. But uh, when I talk about Azazel, everything that's going on right now, it stems from that warfare, the seductive ways of wicked women, pornography, Killing, murdering. This is where your thoughts come from. This is where your savage come from. This is where your ghetto gaggers come from. This is where your, your entertainment, which is Lucifer's realm, come from. Azazel's realm come from. I don't know how long, I, you know, I don't know how I can beat it down to y'all even more. The days of Noah, so the days of Noah, y'all already know the rest. I keep on, I had to keep telling y'all this. And it seemed like America, which is modern day Babylon, I hate to say, is falling in that vein. Now we have this up, up, usurping and uproaring of racial tensions now. Far as the Oscars, I mean, excuse me, far as the Oscars, far as the uh, Black Lives Matter movement, just as all else movement. We have all these cops still killing black males and women, and we have police brutality, and we have this organ situation, racial tensions. All this stems from Azazel. Weapons of war, mass destruction, Azazel. Divide and conquer, order out of chaos. The Illuminati, Masonic term. People, I can go on and on and on about this. But if you don't take time out to investigate it, stop taking everyone who speaks, even me. When y'all listen to me, go behind me and investigate the stuff I put out. Just don't take people's word by happenstance. That's how you get tricked. That's how you get fooled. Me, I always investigate. I don't take everything someone says as a grain, uh, uh, as, a, uh, as a grain of gold. I go right behind the person and figure it out for myself. If you don't do that, you'll be hoodwinked every time. You got people that talk in fourth tongue. You gotta watch these people. They will trick you. They will hoodwink you. They will lead you down a road to no return. I hope you partake and listen to this documentary. I don't care if it's rain, sleet, snowing. I will bring you the knowledge. This is what I do. They weighed heavy on my heavy on my mind, and I had to bring it to y'all so y'all can really get it in your mind. We are living in demonic proportions, meaning that we always been attacked. The demon always been there. The spirit's always been roaming this earth, and I'm giving you the tools to, con to, to fight the real war, which is spiritual warfare. In order to know, in order to Beat your enemy, folks. In order to combat your enemy, you must study your enemy. You must know your enemy like your enemy does to you. All of my productions, peace and blessings. See you to the next video. Be on the lookout in a minute.